This video introduces the Fluent Icing Workspace, a workspace that incorporates the in-flight icing simulation technology of Vance's Fence Up Ice with Fluent in a seamless fashion within a single user interface. The Fluent Icing Workspace leverages airflow, droplet, ice crystal impingement, surface water runback, and ice accretion capabilities. To take advantage of Fluent Icing's full capabilities, Fence Up Ice for remeshing, View Miracle, CFD Post for post processing, and Insight for the post analysis feature should be included in your ANSYS installation. The workspace is available within the Fluent Launcher. Begin by selecting Enterprise under the Capability level and then Icing from the list of workspaces. Click Start to open the workspace. The workspace design is similar to the standard Fluent interface. It contains a ribbon, a graphics window, a properties panel, a project library, and an outline view. The project library contains a list of recent project folders. You can create a new project by clicking the New button in the project ribbon. Name your project file and choose where to save your project folder. To create a new simulation, press Import Case and head to the directory containing your 3D input grid that you would like to import. Name your simulation appropriately and then proceed. For large grids, this step can take a few minutes while a copy of the CAS and DAT file, if it exists, are being copied to the Fluent Icing project. Fluent Icing will create a simulation folder within the project view and populate an outline view for you to begin your simulation setup workflow. When getting started with the workspace, you can step through the outline view to set up your simulation based on your requirements. The outline view acts as a vertical workflow guiding you along the initial steps to setting up your simulation. The setup section defines the type of simulation, the in-flight icing conditions, the physical models, and the boundary conditions to use in your simulation. The solution section defines the solver settings of your in-flight icing simulation, including monitoring, initialization, and output files. Each outline view option, when highlighted, opens a panel allowing you to further configure your simulation. Depending on your drop-down selections, additional menus may appear allowing you to further define extra settings. Under the Setup section, Airflow allows you to define the Airflow Solver by either selecting Fluent or FenceApp. Particles lets you define the Particle Impingement Solver, in this case Drop3D. Vapor Transport can also be enabled as part of the Particle Solution. An Airflow Solution is required to conduct this simulation. ICE defines the ICE accretion solver, in this case ICE3D, and airflow and particle solutions are required to conduct this simulation. Fluent Icing supports five combinations of simulation types ranging from a standalone airflow simulation, a standalone particle simulations with an airflow solution already loaded, a standalone ICE simulation with an airflow and particle solution already loaded, an airflow particle simulation, each simulation is run in sequence, an airflow, particle, and ice simulation where each simulation is also run in sequence. This last combination allows the simulation of single and multiple quasi-steady, multi-shot ice accretion calculations. The Boundary Conditions section lets you define different boundary conditions ranging from inlets, walls, outlets, symmetry, and periodic. Fluent icing supports pressure far field, velocity inlet, mass flow inlet, pressure inlet for the inlet boundary condition, and pressure outlet for the outlet boundary condition. Under Solution, you will define the solver settings of your Fluent Icing simulation, including monitoring, initialization, and output files for each of its Fluent Icing modules, such as airflow, particles, and ice. These solver settings will allow you to conduct the five simulation scenarios mentioned previously, as long as they have been properly selected in the setup panel. The multi-shot menu under the Solution panel is only available when all three solver types have been selected in the setup panel. The total time of icing will be the sum of individual icing times set for each shot. By default, this is a uniform distribution and the per shot time is entered in solution ice. As your simulation runs, you can gather more information from the console output window. Within it, you will be able to monitor the current iteration being calculated, the solver being used, and other various information related to your calculations. When your simulation is complete, a results section appears at the bottom of the outline view. It provides access to the core Fluent post-processing options as presented in the Remote Visualization Client and offers the same options as in Fluent's user interface. You are able to create cutting planes, display mesh surfaces, and contours of solution fields, vectors, path lines, volume renderings, and much more. As you can see, the Fluent Icing workspace leverages airflow, droplet, ice crystal impingement, service water runback, and ice accretion capabilities, all in a seamless fashion within a single user interface. 
To leverage the full capabilities of the Fluent Icing environment, Fensop Ice for remeshing, View Miracle, CFD Post for post processing, and Insight for the post analysis feature should be included in your ANSYS installation. This concludes our overview of the Fluent Icing workspace.